clearly when you have a day like we had today and, and get defeated, uh, it, it is a hard pill to swallow. That was a, a good Coastal Carolina football team. Uh, for whatever reason, on all three phases, offense, defense, and special teams, uh, we weren't ready to go out there and compete. I, I don't know. I can't sit here and tell you the answer because I, I just – uh, it, it's going to take some searching to, to figure out exactly where where it went wrong. Uh, but from the opening play, uh, we, we go out there and we line up wrong in the opening play. We have three kickoff returns that we fumble. We, uh, I mean, it's just I, I don't know what it was at this point in time. Um, it has a lot to do with a Coastal Carolina group that uh, came in there really, really focused with a mentality to win, and, and they certainly did that. But it was a disappointing day. Uh, from our coaching staff to our players to everyone involved, uh, and it's, it's unacceptable. Thank you, Coach. Uh, at this time, we'll take members or questions from members of the media. If you would please identify yourself, and as a reminder, if you're not asking a question, please remain on mute. Thank you. <clears throat> Coach Brady Wilder, Thursday Night dot com. Uh, it was a 7 nothing game in end of the first quarter, and it seemed like there was an opportunity there. Defense got a couple stops, and then it kind of went off the rails in the second quarter. What do you think transpired there? To tell you the truth, I thought it went off the rails right there in the first first play. I mean, um, how do you go out there and, and practice and script the play and take the field and line up wrong unless you're, you're not mentally into it for whatever reason? How do you – had given a, a, a fourth down opportunity where we have our defense on the field and we're, we're in transition between a punt return team or a punt yeah, return team and, and, and have to waste a timeout to give them an opportunity to score a touchdown right there. Uh, that, that was certainly bad. And, and then when you look at our special teams and all the way around, I mean, uh, it, it was off the rails from the start for whatever reason. And that's uh, certainly what I've got to find out and, and why it happened like that. So it, it didn't start in the second quarter. It was very evident in the first quarter from the first play. Hey, Coach, it's uh, Julian from the uh, Signal. Um, I know it was a lot to take in from, uh, from, from this game, but uh, was there anything positive that you saw any, any flashes that you saw maybe from this game uh, at all from this team? I don't, I don't think there's anything you can take from this game. Uh, you know, we, we were consistently bad in all three phases of this game, and it shows when you get be 51 to nothing. Uh, Coach, uh, Jeremy York, Impact Media. How long do you kind of go back and watch the film on this before you kind of wipe the slate clean and look out for uh, ULM next weekend? Well, we got to get we got to get it quick. I mean, uh, we got to be over this thing by Monday. We got to start preparing. We've got a, a mandatory day off for election day on Tuesday that we we, we can't get back. So we we've, we've got to start quick. This thing's got to get through us and out of us. Uh, yeah, I think uh, easily by Monday morning, it's got to be gone and wiped away. <laughs> 